What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to All Things Luxury with me, Asia. If this is your first time on this channel, on this channel, we talk about all things luxury. From designer handbags to designer shoes, all things luxury goes down on this channel. So today, I have here with me my goddaughter, Jade. And today, we will be going over our Bath & Body Works semi-annual haul. All right, so let's get into this video. So you guys know that Bath & Body Works um, they do a semi-annual sale twice a year, I believe, where all their stuff is discounted. And you know me, I love a good sale. So I know on my channel, I talk a lot about luxury perfumes. And that's not to be mistaken that I don't like body sprays. I do like body sprays. There just is a time and a place for body sprays. And um, I don't believe that body sprays should be your everyday fragrance or um, a date night fragrance. So that's why I have my um, designer and luxury perfume videos that I will list below. So this is me showing you guys that you know, Bath & Body Works is still a thing. I still love smell goods and things of that nature. But I just think that as women, we should have um, perfumes. Um, so I have my goddaughter here. She's 10 years old and she's gonna go over the things that I thought that was age appropriate um for um kids because you know kids like to smell good too but you know there's limits to everything all right so let's get into this haul so i'm going to start first with the things that i got and i'm just going to tell you guys what they smell like to me and then i'm just going to get her a live reaction on do she like it um and if she likes it she'll tell me she's very blunt um and she's also going to have a video coming up of her explaining what she wears in my pochette accessoire but she definitely will be having her solo video being posted um maybe the day after this video to so to show what she carries in her bag when she's with her godmother all right so let's get into it so honestly i did not need anything because my closet my stockpile of bath and body works is just like i already have enough but I cannot miss a good sale. Like, we can't miss a sale. All right, so let's start with this one. So I like this little fragrance right here. And this is Winter Berry Wonder. So, you know, like a lot of the stuff that like has winter in front of it or like it's seasonal, those things were like $3.95 and like $4.12 versus like all the body sprays being like $4.95. This one was actually $4.12 because it has winter in front of it. Do I care that it has winter in front of it? No. As long as it smells good, I don't care. So this right here, it smells like a berry. Um, It smells, I, I like how it smells. It's, I, I really can't describe what it smells like. It smells like a berry. It smells like a if it was such a thing as a purple berry, it would smell like a purple berry. Do you, see if you like it. Do you like it? I mean, it smells like, it smells like, I don't know how to explain it, but it smells like passion fruit. You know what? That, it does smell like passion. You know what? It does smell like passion fruit. But, so, you know, I never give you guys the ingredients on my channel because that's not my thing. But, on the back of this um, bottle, it says that it has some vanilla in it, cranberry, and a ruby frost. So, no passion fruit, but it does give passion fruit vibes to me. All right, so I bought that one. The next one we got was fresh cotton and coconut so obviously that's going to smell like what it says it's going to smell like so we're just going to get her reaction on it does she like that i mean it don't really smell like you know um fresh coconut and cotton because like it it just gives like outside vibes Like outside, like how? Like you're in the forest. Like 
like when somebody comes in and like you sm you don't smell good yeah that's what it's giving me i don't like it <laughs> she as a 10 year old she doesn't like it but to me it does smell like fresh cotton and i definitely smell the coconut in it so i'm gonna have to disagree with you but it's okay or whatever i mean we're not supposed to like the same thing and i all i said that in one of my fragrance videos if a kid likes all the fragrance that you wear that lets you know that you need to upgrade your fragrances unless your kid has a really really keen smell and a real real you know taste for luxury or whatever then but if your kid like everything you wear i don't know check that out all right next one might lie. All right, is champagne toast. Everybody loves champagne toast. And I just started wearing champagne toast. So I actually wear my body sprays to bed. I like to wear them to bed. Or if I'm just casually going to the supermarket or something like that, like I'm not dressed up, like I don't really want to smell like um, an actual fragrance, then I'll spray these. Um, but champagne toast, and I also wear um, body sprays to the gym. But champagne toast, everybody knows champagne toast smells amazing. And it says it has sparkling berries, a juicy tangerine, and bubbly champagne. Now let's see if you like this one. This smells like bubble gum. And that is good. It smells good. Yeah, okay, well. She don't agree with me. How it, it doesn't. Smells. I guess it could. It does smell like bubblegum a little bit. It could smell like bubblegum. It, it could. All right. So the next one. Y'all, this one is a throwback from the throwback. The pink chiffon. Oh, my gosh. I remember when I was in high school and this came out and I was so in love. So what is in the pink chiffon? It is a red pear. You have um, the jasmine flower. Um, you have a vanilla. And you also have a chiffon musk in there. All right. Um, it kind of smells like cologne. It does. So with the musk part so there's a musk part in it and you think it smells like a cologne yes kind of i don't really like it all right so you guys what i can say about this fragrance is to me this gives very fun carefree it is to me it gives fun and bubbly i don't really smell the musk in it well i smell the musk but you know i don't like musk but this is not a strong musk all right so that's my fragrance all right so let's get into i'm gonna go over my stuff and then she'll go over her stuff so this candle right here was three dollars and 12 cent why because it is a christmas candle so this is joy which is a sugared snickerdoodle scented candle so honestly i don't care what the candle actually says on it honestly if i want it to sit on my counter I'm honestly not embarrassed for it to have a Christmas tree on here. But if I really wanted to sit on my counter, like I literally would just turn it this way and then you wouldn't be able to tell. She bought two of those. Yeah, the same one. Yeah. Cause I was like, clear the shelf. These are only three dollars. Like if it if it don't smell good, she gonna make it smell good because it's on sale. Now last time I smelled this, I ain't like it. Because it like it, you know, it gives like pine tree vibes. Like, let me tell y'all how it's the smell like for me, and especially it has um snickerdoodle in it. I don't know how to pronounce snickerdoodle. It I don't like snickerdoodles. It smells weird. Like okay, well I just won't burn this while you're here. All right, so we got that candle. And like you said, I got another one. All right, so this one. This one I love, and I was surprised that this one was $3.12 because it really didn't say um, like a season, but this is raspberries and whipped vanilla. 
I like that. It smells exactly what it says it smells like. Ew, this smells so good. This smells like candy. Oh, I thought you said ew. You said ooh. Like, it's it's giving candy pops. Like. Yeah. So, yeah. Definitely love that candle. All right. So, some things that I'm not going to open up because they're kind of self-explanatory. So, I love me wallflowers. So, um, I got, I think wallflowers won't sell for three dollars or something like that four dollars four well dang and that wasn't really much of a cent <laughs> ah, that wasn't really much of a cent oh well they're 750 normally so they were 395 i think oh. right all right so this yeah. is peach bellini i love peach bellini i love a peach bellini candle and this is and so obviously it smells like peaches and this one is pineapple mango and it smells just like what it says so i just got two of those and then um, I had a Bath & Body Works reward, and I decided to get this little wall plug-in to go with um, the wallflower. And that one just said, Love's Win. All right, so my haul is almost over. So I'm going to show you guys my unnecessary buys. She did not have to get it, like, but she was talking to a lady and said, should I get it or should I? Well, I'm going to just get it. Even though she's not going to use it, she just said she was going to get it. But I am going to get it because I think this is so cool. Like, you can shake it. It has the glittery part in there. Like, that is so cute. And then, you know, I love my candles. So, all I have to do is just sit my candle on top of it like this. And then, voila. Like, that is so cute. So, when I saw this, I just had to get it. So, um, yeah. So, the cool thing about this candle is the price, honey. It was on sale. And like she said, you know, I was like, hey, I may not use it. Because I do have a lot of candle holders from Bath & Body Works. But I was like, this one is so cute. Like, shake it up, shake it up, shake it up. And the thing about it, this candle was $59.95. Wait, y'all. I just discovered something. I she didn't know that but there's I knew. There's a switch. I thought she knew that. There's a switch. So what does it mean? Cause it's on off. Okay. All right. Batteries are in there. I can see. Turn it on. What does it do? I don't know. Oh my god. That's cool. Oh, that's gonna be. That's gonna be nice. Like that was definitely worth buying. Yeah. Like, so real. it lights up. So imagine this. Sitting on your counter, sitting on your dresser at night. Beautiful. All right. So, but yeah. So, it was $59.95, but I got it for $15. This is the second one. She going to do the honors of this one. That's All right. Me. So, I don't know if this one has something on the bottom or not, though, because I didn't pay attention to it. So, this one, you still have the sh same shape factor. Put your candle on there. And it can hold a three um three wick candle as well. Because I did try that out. Because I was like, hey, it's just, just a single one. But no, a big candle will fit on there. All right. So this one was $59.95 as well. So I did get this as well for $15. And... This one has an own button as well. So, like, when I got these, I did not know that it had an own button at it, the bottom of it, but it does. So, let's turn it on. So, you really can't see it, but you can. But it has a little glow to it, and I just think it's so cute. Do you like it? Mm-hmm. It's cute. But not cuter than the pineapple. Yeah, the pineapple, the pineapple is doing it. All right, so a couple more things in my haul. So the nursing part of me um, was like, well, we're still in a full-fledged um, pandemic. And so I got these antibacterial hand wipes. And um, these um, wipes are in the scent of Champagne Toast, which I said is one of the best fragrances at Bath & Body Works. And um, there's 30 wipes in here. It's 67% um, alcohol in here. 
And um, I just think these are better than hand sanitizers because let's say you actually have like some residue or something on your hand that you actually want to get off of it. Hand sanitizer is not going to help you, honey. So these were only $2.12, so I had to get these. And the last thing that I got is um, this right here. This sand and sea salt body scrub. Y'all, I bought two of these and I used the first one last night. What I mean is it feels so good. I recommend it versus, I think it's Tree Hut, the sugar scrubs. Yeah, I love this one. So this one is called Fiji Sunshine Guava Teeny. Like, oh my God. So it has guava in it, oranges, and seaside jasmine. And it's also made with coconut oil and walnut shell. So when I mean to tell you, like, I was feeling so refreshed after my shower last night. It was just bomb. So I'm going to hand it over to my goddaughter because I'm done with all the things that I bought. So she's going to show you the things that she got. And then I'm going to see if I like it. So first, we got strawberry soda um, lotion. And this smells so good, y'all. It literally smells like strawberry soda. So I like it. Like, it's giving, it's giving strawberry soda vibes. Yeah, this is, and this is, ve this is very kid appropriate. Because this smells exactly like a strawberry um, soda. So with me personally, I like body creams better than the actual lotion. So I really like this one. And if you want to try it on your hand just to see how moisturizing it could be. You only need a little bit. The texture feels so good. Like feel my hands. Like they feel yeah. super soft. Like so yeah. So I love the body cream. <laughs> yeah, you might not be getting this. I I might have to keep this for me. Nah. Like, whoa. Like it has um so it says it has shea butter in here. So and it says also the ultimate hydration. So this is definitely giving not giving it to you vibes. Yeah. Uh -huh. It says it has fresh um Fresh strawberries, bubble, bubbly, scented crushed ice. Okay. Made with vitamin E, aloe vera, sh um, shea butter, cocoa butter, and hydrosonic acid. All right. Well, I don't know how to fit it. No. Well, I don't know if you're going home with that one. Yeah, this I am. so yeah. good. All right, go ahead, next. And then next, I have Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower and, um, Spray. Now, this smells awesome. It smells like the Bahamas. Like, it's giving very Bahama Passion Fruit vibes. How you know what the Bahamas smell like? You been to the Bahamas? No. Well, I've been to the Bahamas, so let me see <laughs> if this smells like the Bahamas. I do smell the passion fruit in it and the banana. This smells good. This smells good. This is kid friendly um as well. Not something that I don't want to wear, honestly, but nice for you. But I definitely know she gonna like this one. But it's the same thing. This one has a stronger scent to it. Like, so what's that? So it's the same thing. It's Bahamas passion fruit and banana flower, but instead it's soap. It's just soap. Ooh, that smells so good. So shower gel, which has aloe vera in it and vitamin E. Now this actually does smell better. This smells better than the actual spray. Me personally, you know, I don't like Bath and Body Works um, gel? shower gels. Like, I honestly don't. I just, I'd rather stick to Dove and Dr. Teal's and stuff like that. I, I like those type of things. And Dr. Bonner's, I love Dr. Bonner's. So, um, but for a kid, um, this would be a nice bubble bath. So, I may steal it for that. I may borrow it just to do a bow bath. Yeah. But yeah, I know Bath and Body Works, they do like um 
they're good at giving your water like a good bubble. So definitely it a good bubble. Yeah. Good. yeah. Okay, so then I got raspberry lemon sherbet. Okay. I don't know how to pronounce it. Really. Sorbet. Sorbet. And they smell so good, like y'all. So what is that mini thing? So the mini, what mini thing? What is this? Is so this it's the... hand sanitizer. Okay. Oh, and this smells so good. Like. This does smell good. So it literally, the lemon to me outweighs the raspberry. I smell more lemon than anything, you? Yeah, but it still smells good. Like. It still smells good. All right, are you done? Are we? I think we're done with everything. So, you guys, let me tell you what Bath and Body Works then did. So, after me spending all this, and I want to say this was maybe $100, um, which I think was really good. Um, this was $100. So, then I then got a free reward on top of this so now it's like i have to go back to the store and then i check my mail and then i got a ten dollars off of 40 and i'm just like really sway like y'all just want people to spend their money spend their money spend their money so yeah so we may be going back to the bath and body works store just because i love a sale and i cannot let a coupon go to waste honey so you guys if this is your first time on the channel I just hope um, something we said within this long segment will make you want to subscribe. And again, this is my daughter, Jade, my goddaughter, Jade. And you will be seeing more of her on this channel. And if you guys could like, comment, and subscribe, we would really appreciate it. And to my Lux gang, kisses to you all. And may you guys have a great day. Bye.